What is going on everyone? Riddick here. Today we're going to be taking a look at a pair of shoes that I've been wanting for years. I missed out on the last retro of these and I'm not really one to go back and reach back and spend the you know the resale dollars on shoes. I have done it and I have done it mainly with pairs that I know that are going to skyrocket in price and I try to get them before that happens. So I have done it but most of the time I try not to reach back. I try to just get things for retail if I can. And so <clears throat> with this pair, I sort of discovered they were coming out just being on listings on uh, Finish Line and Champ Sports and then they took it down. So at some point they were gonna release these in the summer and apparently it got pushed back because there was no real talk about them. But then, we got it relisted and then Reebok started promoting it and I was like, oh yeah, here we go. Because I had these when I was a kid back in the 90s and you know, everybody was all about Michael Jordan back then, but I'm gonna be straight up honest with you. I was a Shaq guy. I was a Shaq guy for a while back in the day. Loved Michael Jordan, but man, Shaq just, you know, going up there and busting backboards and things like that, man, just, yeah, I was all about Shaq and just seeing him destroy stuff. So I absolutely had to have these shoes back in the day, especially being that they were a pump, because I loved the pump back in the day. The pumps were where it was at in the 90s, man, I'm telling you. And so finally, for the first time since owning the OG pair, we're gonna unbox these right now. Figured we'll do the unboxing here. Maybe we'll do the on foot in this video, and if we don't do the on foot in this video, it'll be coming in another video. So stay tuned for that in case we don't get to it here. Crack these open. And I'm, I'm like super excited for this. Big time. All right. That down. What do we got? Okay. Oh, nice. Very cool box. Very cool box. So here's the box. I have no idea how the retro of these came, what kind of box they came in. I didn't, I didn't really look into that, but here's the box. Shack on the front. It's a really big box. And it's a drawer style. It's a drawer style box. I don't know if that's is that accurate to the OG? I can't remember, man. When I was a kid, dude, I just ripped these things up and put them on my feet right away. So I can't remember. But the box is huge. And it is a drawer style box. Very interesting. But yeah, very uh, stripped down and basic. Shack. So here we go. Man, this is gonna be exciting. Oh, my God. Mm. There they are. A thing of beauty. Oh, my God. Mm-hmm. Wow. There they are. The Reebok Shack Attack. OG colorway. Man. Look at that. An absolute thing of beauty. I've waited so long for this to come back out. I was kicking myself when I missed that first retro. But here they are. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. I think it's the 30th anniversary of these, right? Isn't that what it is? 30th anniversary of these? The last time was the 25th anniversary, I do believe. So, kind of crazy it's been that long. So let me get out the other shoe. Can't just go with the one shoe. We gotta have both of them out. This box put away. This box is cool. Was not in, not in expecting a drawer style box. You know, let me know if you know if that's the original style box. The OGs came in because I don't remember. Like I said, when I was a kid, man, I just ripped the stuff open and put them on my feet. 
but man, there they are. Man, am I happy to have these. So happy to have these. So cool, man. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Wow, I'm sorry, I'm speechless. <laughs> I've waited so long for these. The material, materials are good, just like any of the recent Reebok releases, of course. You have a bit of a tumbled black leather here. you have a little bit of that suede with the Reebok logo there and the pump we got to we got to oh. all right let's do it here we go I got a big foot so you really got to pump it up there's a lot of air space in there <laughs> It's, pretty, it's pumped up pretty good now though. I can feel the uh, pressure there in the tongue. Very nice. Oh yeah, nice and pumped up now. Here we go. Hopefully you guys heard that. I have no idea if you did or not. I got a mic on. I don't know if it came across. Love that. Absolutely love that. I love the tongue. I've always loved the tongue on these. It's so cool. Man. Absolutely love these. Reebok doesn't get enough love for what they've been doing. This is the kind of thing that, with all the collabs they've been doing and everything else, which are absolutely fire. It's things like this that they should be doing too, bringing back the classics. Now, of course, because they brought this back, they're gonna end up doing like 50 colorways of it. That's just their style, that's what they do. <laughs> you know, what are you gonna do? Oh yeah. You can actually tell it's getting pretty tight in there now. It's getting a little more difficult to pump as it fills up. Here we go. Oh, my God. A thing of absolute beauty. I've only said it a million times. I'm going to say it a million and one. A thing of absolute beauty. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. So freaking fresh to death. Like a million bucks. Wow. With that said, let's take a look at them on feet, and we'll be right back. All right, here we go with the on foot. Could not resist getting the on foot in. My God, they've, <laughs> I love these. Absolutely love these. Looks so killer on feet. So happy I got these. Fit is true to size, folks. Fit is true to size. And you can still get some sizes on Reebok and Champs and Foot Locker, maybe even Dick's Sporting Goods. So if you're looking for them, check those out. They may still have sizes there for you. But man, I absolutely love these. I cannot stress it enough. Absolutely love them. And I will say, man, the uh, 
DMX or whatever's in these feels real good. This feels like the legit stuff in here. Like no joke. As soon as I started walking in, I'm like, ooh, okay, okay. Love it. Absolutely love it. Boom. All right, so there they are. The Shack Attack, the Reebok Shack Attack OG. Original Shack Attack. Shack Attack 1, if you want to say, because there were other Shack Attacks. But the OG Shack Attack in the OG colorway. Absolute fire. Man, for all the Jordan praise and craze and all that, Reebok, man, they just don't get enough love and they should and deserve the love. The quality on these is through the roof. I mean, they look sick. Just, I love these. I absolutely love these. Man, I rocked the absolute hell out of these when I was a kid. They were my second pair of pumps. I had the Twilight Zone first, and then that was like a good couple years of, of wearing that thing out. And in between there somewhere, I got the Jordan 6, which was... Uh, the first pair of Jordans I ever got was the Jordan 6, and it was the maroon and white ones. And then after that, got these Shack Attacks, and man. Mm -mm -mm. Wow. Love it. Absolutely love it. With that said, catch you all down the road.